Good afternoon. We are also honored to have with us our eminent guest today. May I request our, past, our president floor, Ms. Vinita Bimbet, to felicitate Ms. Diya Kumari Ji, Her Highness, Ms. Diya Kumari Ji. President Abha Dalmia ji to honor Ms. Ravina Tandon. Sanji, our past president, to honor Kalyani Chawla. I invite our president, Flo. Vinita Bimbet to give a welcome speech. Can you all hear? Not really? I thought it was a little... <coughs> anyway, I have a really loud voice. Is that better? Okay, uh, welcome ladies to Flo. Um, you know, unleashing the power of female entrepreneurship can have a dramatic effect on a country's economy. And this is the cornerstone upon which Flo was created 33 years ago. India's 2025 GDP, and I have used this statistic many times, it can increase from 16% to 60% simply by enabling women to participate in the economy on par with men. The only way and the most effective way that we can achieve this is to create women entrepreneurs. And as a Chamber of Commerce, this is our focus. And today we are gathered here to launch a very innovative product. I won't tell you too much about the product, Bela Badalia, who's conceptualized it, shall tell you more about it. But needless to say, it is a product that could see the launch of many more women entrepreneurs. But we are also here today with three very dynamic women. And if I may say so, our uh, podium has never looked so fabulous and glamorous ever this entire year. <laughs> a little bit about our guests. Princess Divya Kumari Ji, is an icon of modern India. With numerous business ventures, she has educational institutions, she looks after museums, she has NGOs, and she still devotes a huge amount of time as an MLA with a constituency of Savai Madhopur. She actively promotes traditional art and culture and has a foundation which empowers women and men through vocational training, education, and livelihood generation. We are so privileged also to have with us here today, Ravina Tandon, who has supported Flo earlier when we launched our Ahmedabad chapter with Modi ji. She's the mother of two adorable children. And Ravina, as you already know, is multi-talented. She's an actor, producer, and a columnist. She's also involved with UNICEF for the girl child, with DAIRRC, an anti-drug organization. She's the brand ambassador of PETA, IDA, the Spina Bifida Association, and the White Ribbon Alliance. We have all loved her on the screen, and she has won several awards and accolades. She has won national acclaim for Daman, Best Actress Award at the Indian Film Festival of Houston, 
and Chicago, the Avad Sanmar Purushkar, the Dada Sahib Palki Award, and the Iconic Award. And her next release is Shab and Matar, which deal with violence against women. We are also thrilled to have with us Kalyani Saha Chabla, who is best described as a serial entrepreneur. A journey which started many years ago with her boutique Kalyani in Kolkata. It was a first of its kind. Then her career in marketing began at the Oberoi Hotels, where she improved the operating parameters of the hotels globally. She also was instrumental in setting up the Trident chain of hotels in Chennai. As VP Marketing and Communications, Kristen Dio Kutio, India, she built the brand as the most visible in India, maintaining a number one position for 10 years. She also la launched a montage selling Indian art and for 13 years has had an export company designing and manufacturing for Harrods, Galleries Lafayette, Jean-Paul Gaultier, and I could just go on and on. She's also traveled with the former president of India on her business delegation. She was awarded Fiki's Jury Award in the field of entrepreneurship and the Devi Award as well. And she has also written for the Economic Times, Vogue, Harper's Bazaar, and mag Magna Publications. So welcome ladies, and uh, I am especially want to welcome all the ladies from Jaipur. I think we had at least 35 ladies. All of them have come in from Jaipur in support of, uh, I think I should say, Dia Kumari Ji and Vela. Uh, welcome, and we're delighted to have so many of you with us here today. So now I'm going to hand the mic over to Vela, and uh, she is going to take us through uh, the journey of how Dyuti was conceived, conceptualized, and how we hope to launch it today. Veda. Thank you, Vinita. Good afternoon, our Honorable President, Ms. Vinita Bimbet, past presidents, Abha Dalmiya ji, Kusum Ansal ji, Archana Garodia ji, Nita Bhujra ji past presidents and presidium, our esteemed guests, Her Highness Princess Diyakumari Ji, Miss Ravina Tandan, Miss Kalyani Sahachavla, and my dear Flo friends. A very hearty welcome to one and all. Today is a big day, and I sincerely thank each one of you for your valuable presence. Vinita, thank you so much for all the faith and confidence you've shown. It has been a rock of Gibraltar for me. My esteemed panelists, you are strong icons of our society and your ideas, opinions matter to me and to all of us. Thank you so much for being with here today. Princess Diyakumari Ji, I express my gratitude for always prompting me to look closer and work bigger and higher for finding more opportunities for women in Parliament. Thank you. You are one of the key people who have inspired me to start Diti. I extend a warm hug and big thanks to my family and to all my flow friends who have come all the way from Jaipur to be with me today. Thank you. Now, it's a long journey which has led to the creation of this business module. May I request your patience? The film is only for two minutes. Thank you. Kabhi maa banti hoon, kabhi beti banti hoon, kabhi patni, to kabhi behen. Main har rang mein dhalti hoon, हर रिश्ता पहचान मेरी पहचान मेरी रिश्तों से बंधी सृजन का स्रोत हूं मैं पर सृजन कभी मां बनती हूं कभी बेटी बनती हूं कभी पत्नी तो कभी बहन मैं हर रंग में ढलती हूं हर रिश्ता पहचान मेरी पहचान मेरी रिश्तों से बंधी सृजन का स्रोत हूं मैं पर
तो कभी बहन मैं हर रंग में ढलती हूँ हर रिश्ता पहचान मेरी पहचान मेरी रिश्तों से बंधी सृजन का स्रोत हूँ मैं पर सृजन करने का अधिकार नहीं शक्ति बन पूजित हूँ जिस समाज में शोषित हूँ रमा रूप में रमती मैं ही पर समृद्धि का अधिकार नहीं Don't we all see this around us? The number of women entrepreneurs is increasing, but there is still a substantial way to go. Flow has been an amazing platform for me to meet and interact with women from different walks of life. From dynamic homemakers to vivacious business leaders, I've had the privilege to meet many such outstanding women and get inspired to widen my horizons. Flow Swayam, the prestigious program to facilitate and nurture women entrepreneurship gave me a remarkable direction to proceed in. I wanted to create opportunities for women entrepreneurship to grow while controlling the degrees of risks involved in initiating a business. Jewelry business, for example, involves huge risks and costs of fortune to start. Since I've had the exposure in this sector, I wanted to create something that women would love to wear and sell.